As outlined in last week's episode, the battle for ultimate horsepower has hit the sport ute category in a pretty big way. And if you watched last week's episode, you're left wondering either why do we need that much or what's next? As for me, I'm in the latter category. The Scrambler and Renegade 1000 are the biggest, baddest, and most outrageous ATVs in the industry. They are freaking cool everywhere you look, boast horsepower that's bordering on mental, and include options that are far superior to all others. So how could you possibly make the best better? Well, I'm going to show you. The Renegade 1000 took King of the Castle in last week's shootout and won the battle, and I fully agree with Luke's choice of making the Renegade 1000 number one, but at the same time, I know how to make this Rennie even better. The XXC Renegade comes with Fox Podium piggyback shocks. They are a very good shock, work well, and deliver a quality ride. That being said, they're built for a price point and factory spec to Can-Am's requirements. Is that bad? Well, no, but Fox builds the factory series RC2 that are so much better. Factory series means factory specs, and at the Fox factory, they do not hold back. These shocks feature the best technology available and are built specifically for our Renegade. Right up front, you're gonna notice these shocks pretty golden brown color. It's not just a nice look. That color represents the genuine Kashima coating on both the shock body and the piggyback. What is Kashima? Well, it's a proprietary hard anodizing process where the end result is a much smoother surface that not only reduces friction, it also greatly increases the life of wearable parts that come in contact with the Kashima coated surface, provides greater lubrication at higher temperatures, and reduces corrosion exponentially better than a basic non-coated shock. Just like ounces of weight reduction create pounds of improvement, small incremental changes to the shock will increase the performance of the ride, and that's specifically what the Kashima Code does. Adding to those changes are premium Eibach springs that have been specifically specced for the Renegade's weight. While the springs are only single stage, they do a great job assisting the damping of the shock and are a noticeably different diameter from stock. At the end of the day, the most noticeable improvement is going to be the valving of these shocks. Fox is a performance-based company, so they're able to focus their valving on the performance riders. You can't blame Can-Am. They have to appeal to a broader range of users, but Fox is looking to deliver a premium shock to those who know the difference. These factory series RC2 piggybacks are buttery smooth when tearing up the track accept huge impacts with zero bottom out and feature the velocity sensitive damping control technology that delivers custom tuned valving for every application. And while I'm on the topic of custom tuning, the fact that these shocks have high and low speed compression as well as rebound adjustability and the threaded spring preload means that you are going to get the perfect ride every single time. You can count on that. With two simple tools, you can literally custom tune your ride to precisely compress in both high speed and low speed impact situations, as well as rebound or return the shock to extension at your custom rate. Out on the trail, this means you're not only gonna be able to float through the higher speed chop, you're going to be set to crush the nasty square edge holes, fly over fallen trees and exposed roots, and allow your suspension to smoothly rebound when launching over trail side kickers. This shock truly delivers the best performance possible for a bike like this Renegade XXC. If you're looking for the best of the best, look no further than the Fox Podium RC2 Factory Series. If you enjoyed this video, post a comment and let us know what you think. Then click this link to subscribe and that link for more great videos from Dirt Tracks TV.